All right, YouTube, it's a chilly Friday afternoon. I got some really awesome news for y'all in regards to the small pipes. Well, it turns out I don't. I really don't have to save up for a set of small pipes because one of my friends from Norfolk City Pipe Band and Siren City is giving me a set of practice pipes that he does not use anymore, but they do constitute a small pipes, so there we go. I'll have my own set of small pipes. And speaking of small pipes, we're gonna do some bagpipes today. All right, we are going, I'm gonna go ahead and tune up. Sorry for the excess background noise, but, and yes, I know I'm, <laughs> I'm doing, I'm wearing my summer outfit in cold weather, but us bagpipers, we, we sometimes get immune to it. All right, so I'm gonna start. As soon as this car goes by, there's a truck. There's some people right here. Alright, so I'm gonna start by tuning my drones to the chanter. So we're gonna we're gonna come up on drones and we're going to uh, tune to the chanter. When tuning drones, the way we do it is we like to cut, we like to reach up here and we like to turn off the bass drone by tapping the end and then to turn it on we stick our finger in and then we pull it out and it starts the drone back up. Alright, so here we go. We're going to start off tuning the drones to the chanter. I'm gonna have to calibrate it. One second, YouTube. All right, y'all are still going. Uh, let me calibrate this. Let me check my drones real quick, and then we'll get started. We'll we'll tune the drones. All right. So I'm, yeah, you know, this in there. Oh, sorry about that, YouTube. There we go. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and I need to check my tenor drone because it keeps wanting to shut off. Just move that one. All right, where is it? See, there's the inside tenor. Here's the outside tenor. Pull it out of the stock real quick. I can check it. I know it's a bit chilly out here, YouTube. I don't even know why I decided to wear. Here, check the read. All right, let's see. All right, so I need to. I know I'm shaking a little bit, YouTube, but that's what it's, okay, well, let's try it. Try that. Sounds good. All right. Now I'll put that back in the stock. All 
I'm kind of shaking a little bit YouTube because it's a bit chilly, but that's because <laughs> I'm wearing shorts and stuff and a t-shirt, but no problem. We're going to, okay, I'm going to go ahead and get my drones. All right. You know what? Be before I start tuning, let me go ahead and check my bass drone. So there we go. Go ahead and get this out of there. All right. So there we go, YouTube. Y'all get to see me tune my own bagpipes. Oh. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now let's put it back in the stock. It seems like it's working good. All right. There we go. Now we can get the pipes and now we can start tuning without having to worry about shutting the drones off. All right. YouTube so y'all just got to see me calibrate my own drone my own drones and tune my drones to the chanter so I'm going to do a quick march and round of rowan tree and we're gonna test these out now that I have figured out how to do my own bagpipe drones calibrated all right let's do
YouTube, there we go. Tuning of the bagpipes, plus calibrating the drones, and a little bit of marching with Rowan Tree, and some good news about some Scottish small pipes, even though I'm getting practice pipes, I'm still considering them small pipes. So, I really don't have to worry about saving up for my own Scottish small pipes, because one of my friends, thanks to my good friend Andrew, from Norfolk City Pipe Band, for gifting me his Scottish practice small pipes. Alright, thanks for watching, and more to come later.